Welcome to our review on how to actually answer a six mark question. So what we've got here then is a six mark question from one of the previous B1 exam papers. So the question we've got is Emma takes her sick cat to the vet. The vet says it has cat flu and that the virus infected the cells of the cat's lungs. The virus must have got past the cat's defense mechanisms. The vet says that cats have similar defense mechanisms to humans. Emma thought the cat's body should have stopped the virus infecting its cells. Suggest how the flu virus got into the cat and describe the cat's defense mechanisms against the virus. So the first thing we really need to do here is identify the two things that we've got to talk about in our answer. And the key thing with these six mark questions is there are always going to be two things to talk about. So what we're going to do first of all is have a read of this last sentence here again. Suggest how the flu virus got into the cat. That's our first thing, so let's highlight that. And then the second thing we need to talk about in our answer is to describe the cat's defense mechanisms. So they're the two things that we actually need to talk about when we put our answer together. So when we actually come to structure our answer, the first thing we're gonna do, suggest how the flu virus got into the cat. And earlier on in the question, it tells us up here that the cat got the virus from the cells of the lungs. So that hopefully tells you that the cat breathed it in. So that's our first point that we can write down. And you can use bullet points for this, which is quite nice. So our first thing we're gonna say is the cat breathed in the virus. Now, second thing we've got to do then is describe the cat's defense mechanisms then. So because we're breathing things in, hopefully we remember that in the respiratory system, then we do have this mucus that lines the airways. And the way that that actually is gonna help then is it's gonna trap the bacteria or the viruses that we're trying to breathe in. So the next thing we can say is talking about the defense mechanisms. So there is mucus that lines the airways. We could also talk about the things that could have actually influenced the fact that it's infected the cells. So if it overcame that mucus, what we then go on to talk about is what's actually a defense mechanism inside the cat. And hopefully we remember there are white blood cells. So the last thing we've got to do then is just add a bit of detail to these. So we just need to say how the mucus actually prevents this infection. So once we've got that lining the airways, the virus would be trapped. By the mucus. So we've explained that one. And then we do the same for the white blood cells here. So we've got white blood cells. So the white blood cells will engulf and digest the pathogen, or in this case, the virus. So that's actually the sum total of our answer. And you can see, even though they give us all of these different lines here, you don't have to fill them up with extensive writing. So if you were to look at how this is actually marked then, the cat breathed in the virus, that one little sentence there is our level one answer. And that gets you two marks. If you then went on to identify one method by which the cat has a defense mechanism, so either this one or this one here, then they are level two answers, and that's worth four marks to us. And then for explaining it, so this one here and this one here, those are the level three answers, which gives us six marks. So just for those few points, you get six out of six on that question.